sorry everybody i've been meant to make a video about this but i had to go ahead and give my opinion and everything you know i think it's a very unfortunate situation i want these ladies to forgive each other and move on but unfortunately it seems as if they want to make an example out of each other or allegedly allegedly like this seems to be like a real battle like 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 we're watching national geographics and you got like a ram and a goat and then on locked horns and it, it's just intense but shout out to team z for posting an article july 13th of 2021 Cardi B off the hook in blogger suit, still taking her to trial though. So in other words, Cardi B, you know, the, the counter suit that Tasha K filed, basically Cardi B is not being sued any longer by her, even though she's being sued by a ton of other people, but her suit against Tasha K is still going for the record. So let me go to read to what teams he wrote. Cardi B scored a legal victory in her ongoing battle with the blogger. A judge just tossed the blogger's countersuit against the rapper. The court ruled in favor of the rapper, saying the blogger, Latasha K, couldn't prove Cardi was connected to the assault and emotional distress she claims to have suffered back in 2019. In documents obtained by TMZ, the judge said Latasha, quote, failed to produce any evidence that Cardi herself threatened Latasha or made her believe that she was going to harm her. The judge continued, quote, instead, Latasha has only made allegations that others who may be associated with, not even who are, but who may be associated with Cardi made these threats. And she failed to demonstrate here that the threats were directed by Cardi or committed by anyone working for her. As we, we reported, Latasha claimed Cardi assaulted her, even though they were never in the same room. And she was in such fear for her life, she felt compelled to reach out to the FBI. In any event, the judge ruled there wasn't enough evidence to support Latasha's claims and dismissed them. By the way, she got a similar reaction from the FBI. So the judge and the FBI are basically saying like, hey, no comprende. By the way, she got a similar reaction from the FBI which told her to move if she was so concerned. That sounds wow. Like really, they really said that? Like, did they actually? That's crazy. As for Cardi's defamation suit against Latasha for saying Cardi was a, a <laughs> substance abusing two to the pros with the citada. I think I can say STD on YouTube. I'm pretty sure I'll be okay with that. But a <laughs> two to the pros who uh, abused narcotics and as an STD, uh, that's still alive and likely headed for trial. Wow. That's what she said. I, I mean, it's been so long. I kind of forgot the details. But anyway, long story short, man, I, I, you know, I don't want to see these ladies suing each other. I, 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 you know, I'm going to reach out to Cardi personally and I'm going to ask her to drop the suit. And you know what she's going to say? No, I ain't dropping nothing except for these panties for all sake. You know what I'm saying? Listen, she tried to play me. She tried to talk crazy. And she didn't know I was way crazy than she could ever be. You know what I'm saying? I'm Cardi B and the B stands for crazy. Cardi, crazy spell with a C. Well, whatever. The point is I'm nuts. I don't play no games. I'm like homegirl from the Powerpuff Girls. And she crazies me. No, I'm crazy to her. My eyes twitching right now as I'm talking. Okay, Cardi. Well, anyway, long story short. Okay, I just reached out to Cardi. Uh, Y'all can see she's not backing down. Okay, she's just backing it up for offset. Shout out to my girl Cardi B with your fine self. Shout out to Tasha K. I hope that y'all, uh, listen, honestly, I hope that this will, see, they're both wasting money. The court is being wasted on this foolishness. Let's just be real here. I hope that, the, that they drop the case. I hope that the judge is like dismissed. No, nobody owes anybody anything except for y'all. Y'all need to apologize to each other, and, and we're just gonna leave it at that. And then I hope that Tasha just doesn't mention t uh, Cardi B again. Cardi doesn't mention Tasha again, and they act like they never met, spoke to each other, never exchanged energies with each other. Because this is just sheer foolishness. This is a ridiculous lawsuit. Cardi B is being sued by millions of people. <laughs> okay allegedly being sued by multiple people she has multiple cases going and she doesn't need the stress she just had a baby she was just pregnant and not to deal with like foolishness like this this is a stupid case I, I i mean just the whole the whole case is dumb none of it makes sense and um over a youtube video like really anyway shout out to both of these ladies you know i wish them nothing in uh, 22 2022 but good health and major wealth Oh, they make millions. Oh, they twerk it up and enjoy themselves, enjoy their husbands, enjoy their lives, enjoy their kids, and just enjoy themselves, you know, because 
life is short. There's a lot of crazy stuff going on. The supply chain thing. And, you know, they're talking about a potential food shortage. <laughs> they're talking about America is about to turn into the purge. I mean, I I'm scared as hell, y'all. You know, but anyway, stay locked, clock, locked, cocked, and loaded, y'all. Because they're, they're saying that some crazy stuff is coming down the pipe. And, 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 and are y'all scared like me? Anyway, shout out to Cardi B. Shout out to Tasha K. Wish her nothing but love and, and money and good health and, and all that good stuff, man. Anyway, it's about to be Christmas time. I'm recording this October 27th of 2021. Wednesday, October 27th of 2021. It's almost Thanksgiving and then Christmas. A month or two from now, you know, going into the holiday season. It's about to be Halloween. You know, I, I, just, I just hope these ladies forgive each other. All right, y'all, I got to go.